Helios 1 in the middle of the night. It's got a lot of antennas in the distance. Oi. Folks. What's up? Keep walking. Can't, I, you do realize it's not a road. This is a restricted area. State your business. I... I am uh, with the NCR. Anything I can do to help? You're being here as a start, soldier. We aren't exactly overflowing with troopers here. But if you really want to help us, talk to the idiot with sunglasses in the back of the plant building. He's been trying to get this place running for months and hasn't made any forward progress. Shouldn't there be more people than this defending a power plant? There should be more of us. But we aren't getting much power in this plant. For various reasons. So... None of our enemies have a big interest in it either. Not like Hoover Dam, anyway. We had a real fighting force here just long enough to take it from the Brotherhood of Steel. And they got sent east to the dam like everybody else. Caesar's Legion sends skirmishes every so often. Prodding for weaknesses, mostly. The reality is, if they really wanted it, we'd all be dead. Why was the Brotherhood of Steel here? <sighs> Damned if I know. Put up a hell of a fight, though. We had them outnumbered, I don't know, 21 to 1, maybe? They held out as long as they could. Lost most of their force before they retreated. Gave us a little parting gift, too. They had some of the plant running, but they shut it all down. Enabled an old security system, too, to keep us away from the controls. Y yeah, why are you here, though, and not on the front lines? Isn't that more important? I ask myself the same question all the time. But energy's hard to come by around here. Who gives you more control over this area than troops ever could? If we lose the dam to the Legion, this little plant may be our last stand. Mm-hmm. Okay. Try not to make any trouble. I'm trying. I'm trying. But that lucky old son talk to the idiot wearing sunglasses in the back of the Helios one. We're going to talk to some glasses that are wearing an idiot. It's complicated. Lieutenant Haggerty. She doesn't have a very good posture. Oh, look at this mud. It's all injured and stuff we won't go quietly the legion can count on that yeah i need to it's a good thing that i was able to lie there because otherwise i don't think i, I would what have is able... it a busy woman i fine i don't think i would have been able to come in here uh this place is big and it's got enemies in it and uh it's it, it, it yeah it is claimed by the ncr though so we'll find out how this is gonna work out Excuse me. Hi. You have a computer over here. I can mess with the computer? Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. That sounds like a yes to me, honestly. Archimede Archimedes testing. On Tuesday, February 12th or 16th at 2 p.m., technicians will be running a test for Archimedes and its connectivity with our plant security system. Under no circumstances should any employee be outdoors on the plant grounds until the alarm klaxon has ceased and an all clear is given. We have death and dismemberment waivers from all employees on file and are not responsible for any accidents that should occur during this procedure. Protective eyewear is mandatory for all technicians observing from the tower deck. This is all pre-war, as far as I know. The initial testing of Archimedes was a success, though not an unqualified one. Several minor systems were overloaded, despite all precautions taken, and the two and a half minutes of downtime following the test is something we can work on improving. More importantly, we received reports from nearby facilities that they experienced system-frying power fluctuations at the time of the test, notably the Black Mountain communications array, which actually is going to tie into when we go to the Black Mountain, I think, potentially. I'm pretty sure it does tie into that. And um, the military bunkers at Hidden Valley that uh, we have been to already, and we didn't know there were military bun bunkers down there. We're going to make it a priority next time to prevent such collateral damage. Wait a minute. That's pre-war, isn't it? Oh, so maybe it doesn't tie into the Black Mountain thing. Uh, we've heard of the Black Mountain. We got a radio uh, signal from there. 
Brigadier General Scott Lowy of the U.S. Army will be visiting the facility starting next Monday and staying on site indefinitely. When Archimedes goes live, he will be the only person here allowed to authorize its use for anything other than a test. Civilian employees are not required to salute, but it is expected of everyone that you observe thorough grooming and hygiene regimens and dress neatly while the general is with us. The general expects the best from all his men, and Poseidon men should be no different in the presence of such a fine and decorated soldier. The, wim the women can be different, it's fine. What can you tell... Oh, can I tell him is the quote unquote thing. A Poseidon energy publication for new employees. As a member of... Oh, this is fun. It's about corporate espionage. As a member of the Poseidon family, it will be natural for you to become enthusiastic about, about the incredible endeavors you'll be undertaking with us and to want to tell others. But just a second there, my good man, let's take a minute to consider what could happen if company information fell into the wrong hands and whose hands those might be. Quote, can I tell my wife? Unquote. Well, let's say you do. You tell her not to tell anyone. Your bond is sacred, but a woman's idle tongue is the devil's plaything. Not yours. No sooner do you leave for work the next day, she's on the phone telling her best friend, Candy. Then Candy tells Jerty, which is a name. Jerty tells Maxine. Maxine tells Lulu. And while Lulu is telling Doris, a Chinese agent posing as an American operator listens in, and the next thing, she's on the line with the Forbidden City, singing line, uh, sing, singing like a, tr a treasonous canary, the fo because she's a woman, the, because of the canary. She, f the following day, you and your wife are bound, are bound in shackles, and China is sitting at the controls of our entire arsenal. What can I tell my children? What father wouldn't want his kids to look up to him? Don't be that father. One, don't, because the kids, they shouldn't look, do that. One day at school, Ivan Bulikov will get more than lunch money from uh, out of your kids. He'll have the national secrets, or national secrets, and while they're parading him through Red Square as a national hero, your children will be working in forced labor camps, because that's what we have in the U.S. And in fact, that is the case, in fact. Uh, and also, it would make a lot of sense that they would, but it is canonical, I'm pretty sure, forced labor camps um, uh, in, for the U.S., no, I mean, it is also canonical because it's from before the 50s. The U.S. had forced labor camps during World War II. Um, but I, I'm talking after World War II in the setting of Fallout. Uh, but anyway, uh, the, right next to you and your beautiful young wife, who is now wrinkled and homely since the communists have banned makeup because it expresses individuality. Quote, can I tell dr my drinking buddies, unquote, surely if there's somewhere safe a man can place his trust, it's his. It's with his other male friends. But how much do you really know about them? Are they friends? Or comrades? Don't be too, too sure. Even the most transparent window can hide secrets when it's lined with iron curtains. And that's obviously a reference to the wall, I'm pretty sure. Is the wall... It is a reference to the wall, but I don't think the wall is canonical in the setting of Fallout. Hmm. I'm talking about the Berlin Wall, obviously. Always remember, you are a member of those uh, of two families now, and you have obligations to both. But your obligation to the Poseidon family is greater, because while your children may misbehave, misbehave and your friends may change, and your wife may nag and cheat on you because she's a woman, Poseidon Energy will always be paying for the, and protecting your way of life. Don't tell anybody about anything about the, pro the projects of Poseidon Energy. When pressed, tell them that your job is repetitive and not worth discussing. But the company is nurturing and gives good benefits and is always looking for new talent. <laughs> I like that last bit. I always remember this particular thing over here. It's about as goofy as it gets. Uh, and it is pretty in-depth as a, as a satire, Fallout-style satire goes. Uh... Some interesting things in here. What is that? Just around. Let's get some some light up in here. I might need the food over here. Because I haven't eaten in a while. And, of course, we're trying to cozy up. Ooh, pulse grenades. My god, these people just have things lying around. Hi. I definitely didn't steal everything from you. Let's get out of here before they notice. Is this the control room? I think so. Excuse me, are, are your glasses the uh, idiot wearing glasses? Or are you the idiot wearing glasses? I'm sorry, I'm an idiot who doesn't wear glasses. We got machines over here. Respirators and whatnot. Excuse me. Who the hell are you? 
they bring you in to replace me? They're replacing me, aren't they? They... Uh, fantastic is your name. The... Why are you worried about being replaced? Worried? Do I look worried to you? I've got this under control, baby. No one else can do what I do here. What do you do here? What else? I'm in charge. This whole operation depends on me. No fantastic, no power. Got the whole NCR suckling my teats. And it feels so good. Okay, what are you trying to accomplish? Well, see, we're getting power because the guy running this place is fantastic. But the mirrors outside aren't aimed right, so we're running at 1% efficiency. And I guess that just isn't good enough for some assholes. Trouble is, most of the controls for this place aren't here. They're in the tower. And that place has some crazy pre-war security system that the dumb shit NCR set off when they took over. Killed two guys. Now they won't go near it. They want me to make an omelet, but I can't break any of their eggs. Know what I'm saying? How would someone retarget the mirrors? There's these two terminals outside. They control the mirrors. I tried fooling with them, but didn't get very far. You'd have to get them to talk to the mainframe up in the tower, then do the rest from up there. I'm guessing, but it sounds good, right? Hey, you're not thinking about going up there, are you? I am now. Well, hey, if you find yourself up at the mainframe, do yourself a favor and make sure you send the power to the right place. It needs to go to the Strip and McCarran. Why should the power go to the Strip and McCarran? Because I get paid, that's why, per kilowatt hour. Whatever the hell that is. That's where the NCR wants the power, so that's where I want it. But you know, you do that, maybe I put in a good word for you with them. Fantastic's little helper. There's a reputation you can hang your hat on. You know what? I did come here to get a reputation with the NCR. So maybe we're gonna do that. Who knows? Uh, we haven't been to McCarran, uh, but the strip here. It's interesting that it's the strip and McCarran. I, I, yeah, that is interesting. I probably will do that uh, because it also suits my, my, uh, my needs. Um, what exactly do you do? He's, uh, oh, by the way, he's obviously being portrayed as an idiot, uh, which is also a commentary on the NCR and not just a commentary on a random uh, character uh, because, of course, they sent him here. What do you do exactly? Fuck, man. Everything. I push buttons. I turn dials. I read numbers. Sometimes I make up little stories in my head about what the numbers mean. Like one time I imagined they were a code to get into a vault full of naked women. Man, how cool would that be? I believe that's well i wouldn't know about them being naked but there's i'm not sure if it's canonical actually there was supposed to be in fallout 3 the original fallout 3 not the one that ended up existing um there was supposed to be a vault 69 and there was also a vault 68 which is basically the same thing except with the genders flipped uh, vault 69 was supposed to be one man and a thousand women or something like that and the vault 68 was supposed to be one woman and a thousand men, uh, and I'm not sure if they are actually built into any game, but they were just goofy ideas. Fall three, of course, never made it into even production. I think so. It was just like in the, uh, it's all in the uh, design documents and, and stuff. So you have no idea what you're doing. No, man. I know exactly what I'm doing. I just don't know what effect it's going to have. Over there, controls power in this building. That station has readouts on the computer network. That big knob there makes a crazy noise. Uh, sparks come out of that slot if you put stuff in it. And I'm learning more every day. How did you get this job? It was easy, man. They were going door to door asking if anyone knew any scientists. I said look no further. They asked me if I knew anything about power plants. I said as much as anyone I had ever met. They asked me how well I understood theoretical physics. I said I had a theoretical degree in physics. They said, welcome aboard. Smart move. Here. you want this. It's the password to one of the terminals outside. Found it written on one of the stalls in the bathroom. Yeah. I, I, I don't think I'm going to need many passwords. We'll see. We'll see. So, that's our mission. 
And of course we have to go everywhere. I wonder where he's putting things for sparks to come out. Hello. Hello. It's unusual to see a new face here. Are you a soldier or a scientist? I... More of a drifter. I see. Then you must have some special business here for them to have let you through. Yeah, they're looking for help getting this plant running. Interesting. Forgive me for prying, but I'm curious. Are you with a particular group? I mean, this is your turf. For all I know, you could have me killed for my allegiance. A allegiance? That's the one. Allegiance. Who are you with? Very well, yes. I'm part of the followers of the apocalypse. If you're not familiar, we seek peace and the spread of knowledge. Knowledge that must never be lost to the world. Now your turn. The followers of the apocalypse, huh? Not to be confused with the bright followers. I'm not really sure who they are. I don't remember. But the followers of the apocalypse, I know who they are. I know where they are as well. Uh, and I kind of might want to go there sooner rather than later. We'll see. Um, I want what you want. Yes. Um, yeah, I want what you want. That's reassuring. Although many who've made that claim to the followers of the apocalypse over the years have had less than pure intentions. But if it's really as you say, then take my advice. This installation carries with it dangers that no one here has realized. Take care what you do here and who you listen to. Some things are best left buried with the old world. What more is there to this place than a power plant? I don't entirely know. Our records on the company that built this place suggest that their dealings were not only in energy, but also in weapons. And I've seen equipment here marked with symbols used by the pre-war military. Targeting computers, shock sensors. A code word comes up repeatedly in the papers I've looked through here. Archimedes. You think Archimedes is a weapon they built here? Yes. And the technology they have in this facility is like nothing I've seen. Some of it reminds me of Enclave equipment, but more advanced. A weapon based upon it would be catastrophic, no matter who claimed it. It's no wonder the Brotherhood wouldn't give it up. The Brotherhood of Steel knew about Archimedes. They weren't here for me to ask, but I doubt they were here for electricity. When the NCR first came here, it was under Brotherhood control. They usually steer clear of one another, but something here changed their minds. The Brotherhood's interest in pre-war technology has always been in weapons. It's likely they were trying to reclaim Archimedes when the NCR arrived. And did the NCR doesn't know about the weapon? Not yet. By some miracle, they've hired an imbecile to try and decipher the systems here. He spent months working at one console trying to get the solar reflectors to track the sun. What he doesn't know is that the only thing the console controls is the plant's intercom system. I tried to tell him, but he insisted that the largest console had to be the most important. Still, it's only a matter of time. He doesn't know a lot of stuff, dude. He doesn't know a lot of stuff. The NCR asked me to help increase the powers uh, or the plant's power output. Then I would say do it. As long as the power of this plant is committed to the regional grid and not to a weapon, we are safe. If you're the one to restore output, then you can route the power where you choose, and they'll never be the wiser. I can't get you past the security in the tower, but I can be of some help. I've discovered a password for one of the mirror control terminals outside. You'll need it. I think I have two passwords now. Eastern Reflection... Yeah, I need to look at those. Why would you trust me with this? I'm a man of letters. I'd be torn to pieces by the security system they have in that tower. I'd never reach the mainframe. But eventually, the NCR will. Or if not them, Caesar's Legion. They will use this place for war. Because the possibility exists, you might do anything else. You're the only choice I have. It's kind of interesting that the game... This is the only Fallout game that I know of that treats... This is including the original two Fallout games, by the way. That treats weapons of mass destruction with this sort of care. Not, so, I mean, certainly from a narrative perspective, but also from even having a single character who talks about it. Because in Fallout 1, there's a nuclear bomb. Uh, I'm not going to tell you where it is, but there is one. And nobody mentions it. It's just there. And uh, you can do with it as you are able to. Uh, but, yeah. There's no commentary about it. In Fallout 2, uh, there are also nuclear reactors. It's not so much a nuclear weapon, but, it, well, it works as a nuclear weapon. Um, but, you know, they're means to an end.
but the the in Fallout 3 Bethesda just Bethesda oh my god Bethesda anyway uh let's forget Fallout 3 but th what this game is doing right now is putting you in a situation where you have control over even the existence or we are going to be in that situation but uh, the existence of a weapon of mass destruction and we can make sure that it doesn't come to happen and this guy is actually putting it in very simple terms you don't know who is going to have power over it maybe not today or maybe not tomorrow but in a few years the legion can can uh, take control over it and it's it's very true it's very true and of course you can kill the re the legion but are the brotherhood any better the brotherhood are uh, an interesting i look forward to messing with them they're 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 very interesting um faction very tight which is which just does justice to the original games brotherhood very very tight knit community uh, sh uh where should i root the power oh the ncr has their own designs for it no doubt but resist the urge to send it only to the thriving communities. The need for power is great everywhere. Distributing it evenly is the most rational and humane choice. Yeah. That's true. Goodbye. Mm-hmm. I guess I'll find out... Uh, I'll, I'll... Well, we'll both find out what I will do, won't we? Uh, distributing it evenly. Anyway, we need to go so many places, really. The Mojave Wasteland. And I can't wait too much time. Because we only have like three days. And uh, yeah. Let me make sure I, uh, I've been everywhere. Around here. Fresh apple. Really? I'll take that. I don't like that the apples are all nice and pretty. They should be ugly. Like Fallout's apples. What do we have over here? More... Of the same as downstairs. Aha! Uh -huh. Eastern reflect uh, Reflector Control Terminal Password. So, how many passwords do we need? Oh. So we still want the Deathclaw Egg. Yeah, that's gonna take a little while. Uh, but I don't know who gave us all the passwords. I think some of them were repeated passwords. And we also have that multiple times. Hmm. It was both over there and in the on the table. Is that a helmet? No, that's a basketball. Okay. Okay. So everything has been explored. And that means we're going out this way. And getting experience. And there's not even enemies out here. Which is not that much of a surprise. No, there are enemies. They're just not... thought I heard somebody shooting. They're just not uh, in here. Because this, this place is all barricaded. If you come in from the outside... There's no wire cutters in Fallout. I mean, in, Fall in Fallout New Vegas. Don't question my sarsaparilla drinking habits. We got some mongrels. Mongrels are friendly? No, they're not. Excuse me. Oh, no, that's not a mongrel. I mean, I thought... Keep walking. No, because there's, there's some enemies over there. Okay, so very unfriendly people. Oh, these guys are stationed out here. That's pretty important to remember. That there's some people out here. For later. For when we... Activate that thing that says that nobody can be out here. Remember how we read about that? And uh, we probably will be able to activate that. And uh, no, we won't do it, though. But we got a computer. Let's see what I can do. Disarm the bear trap. All the bear traps. You're going to go through there, aren't you? Get out. Okay, I'm not sure what that was. Oh, it was a shotgun. <laughs> Dang it! Broke all my things. It's fine. I, I clicked on it. Ah, it's, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, I have the password. I'm entering automatically. Reset mainframe connection. 
technicians will be running an Archimedes or test of Archimedes and its connectivity with the plant security system under no circumstances should any employee. So that's basically the same as before. So let's reset the mainframe connection. And that's half the job done. And of course, I'm I'm I have a broken leg now, so you know, I'm a little bit on the limping side of things, but you know, we we don't worry too much about that. Um cuz we have Dr. Mitchell. Oh, also have a concussion. I forgot to mention that. It's fine. It's fine. We can I can see. I don't know what you're talking about. Definitely don't I'm not irritable losing I don't actually know what concussions do. Fortunate, I'm fortunate enough to never have had one. Ooh. Oh, that's rubbish. Eddie. Oh, it's the Lila. Sure. You have some... April for me. Because I can open this. I'm a caution, but I think it's going to be fine. Oh, they're fighting. It's fine. Let's see. Oh no. We didn't break it. What do we get? Flame or fuel and just some rubbish. And of course we have Eddie. Speaking of rubbish. Doing things. I don't know what he's doing. Oh. Oh, I know what he's doing. Sure. Let me give you my things. There's dogs in there. That's the dogs that I remember. If y'all don't mind doing that, I got a little bit of a headache right now. I mean, Lady is the bravest of them all. But I have a power fist. <laughs> I don't know why she was laughing. These are NCR guard dogs. And we just come in here and kill them. No mines, though, so that's an improvement. Uh, and we reset. Okay. Now we need to use Helios 1 mainframe to send power to a destination. I need to get up there. Limping all the way. There's some toolboxes over here. Let's go. Ugh. Uh, did I come out this way? No. This is the solar... This is the tower. It might have enemies. Oh yeah, it does have enemies. Um, I am thinking I might want to. When I was a kid, Dad told me the legend of Dead. Okay, that's no on. What you? Wait, 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 wait! Oh no! Oh no! Eddie! Eddie's gonna die. There's a freaking turret up there. There's turrets all over. Where's the computer? There's no computer to control the turrets? Yes, you are, but... Oh, my God. Companions. Oh, companions. Delilah. There we go. Oh, seriously, don't don't go, don't go. I can do this. The the everything is broken. I think this might be the way. Why is it not open? This is Mines Day today. There's a computer over here. Okay. Uh, what do we have? Um, prayer. Prayer. Hmm. Pray. That could be it. Yes, it is. Good. It's proper. And now what do I do? Reconfigure targeting parameters. Deactivate. Deactivate the turrets. But it didn't deactivate the robots, though. Delilah, you are the worst person. Do you know what the worst person is? It is you. Told her specifically not to be here. And what does she do? Immediately be here. Fortunately, she's immortal, so yay for that. I can see what that robot is. Robo brain. Robo brains. They're the best robots. 
So there's some mines over here being. They definitely. Oh. The one that wins. They. They definitely they're not not inside us at all. I don't know what she's talking about. Okay. She really wants to tell that story though. 